As we've covered many times before, Aaron Lewis, the stained frontman and highly successful solo country artist in his own right, is quite unhinged when he's on stage. He doesn't care what anybody thinks, and that often elicits quite funny, but also sometimes tense moments on stage. He's quick to call out hecklers, but he's also quick to tell numerous hilarious stories from the stage. And that brings us to today's episode where he talks about Hinder, the band that was very, very successful in the mid 2000s. There was a time where they had multiple singles on the radio, uh, constantly in rotation, Lips of an Angel, Better Than Me. They were very, very huge. Uh, had a major label deal at that time. Currently, they've kind of fizzled out a little bit, but they're still out there. They're still grinding. This happens with every band. Everybody peaks at some point, but they're still out there doing their thing for sure, drawing tons of fans out to their shows. So that's not a diss on them. They're still doing well. But again, there was a time where they were massive. And that happens to literally every single rock band at one point or another, unless you're Metallica. So anyhow... (laughs) Aaron Lewis tells a story about the guitarist of Hinder in which he says this guy is somewhat of a glutton for punishment. He makes him out to be uh, quite a crazy individual who seems to be somewhat fearless in a very gross manner. So uh, we're going to warn you here that this is highly outrageous and suggestive content. So if you're in a place where you're playing this and you don't want others to hear a really crazy story, you should probably cut it now. We're going to do our best to bleep it to stay within and respect YouTube standards. Don't get mad at us. Those are their rules and we have to respect them if we're going to be here. So this is from a show at the Florida Theater uploaded by a user named Jason Griffith. Shout out to him. Uh, Here is a little bit of that clip showing Aaron Lewis talking about the guitarist of Hinder. It is crazy. There's this band that we took out on tour with us a long time ago. Their name was Hinder. It was one time that they uh, they were all up on my bus. We were hanging out. We were hanging out. And uh, and the guitar player for for Hinder, he's got problems. He has drinking problems. He definitely has some sort of sadomasochistic self mutilation freaking thing going on. I've seen him take his ball bag and stretch it to about eight inches across. <laughs> so, this dumb mother, as I said, Mind you, he has a very stretchy ball bag. (laughs) This is important to the story. (laughs) He stood on my bus. Well, not just my bus. All the new buses, they have Star Trek doors. So you push a button, it goes... And it opens up. So this stupid mother... He stood... He stood in the bunk hallway, which is on one side of that Star Trek door and a chick holding his nuts stood on the other side of the door. Now mind you, the subject of this conversation is what hurts the most. So, this is the scenario. She's got his ass in her hand, and they're pulled as far as they're going to stretch. And he's standing on one side of the Star Trek door on the carpet, and she's standing on the other side of the Star Trek door on the tile. And I push the close button, <laughs> and that door closed, and there was just two stretched. Kind of like a big oversized peanut that only had two peanuts in it. And I pushed the lock button. And I left that stupid mother there with his balls in the door for like a minute. Aaron really pulls no punches here, and it seems like he is not much of a fan of Hinder. 
and uh, having toured with them, it would certainly be awkward if they happen to cross paths again in some future because he doesn't seem to make this guy out to be the brightest candle in the home decor section, so to speak. Aaron Lewis is known for saying divisive things. People love him. There are many, many, many people out there, millions of people who love him, and then there are some out there who hate him and disagree with him. But anyways, Aaron Lewis is always a constant source of entertainment. He has a new record coming out called State I'm In. He dropped a new single uh, that is quality music, always is from Aaron Lewis. Good stuff there. Uh, and you can check that out on wherever digital music is consumed or purchased in physical formats. Uh, so yeah, that is all for now. Thank you so much for joining us here today. You can check out these recommended videos. And if you're new here, you can subscribe to Rockfeed with notifications on so you don't miss out on breaking hard rock and heavy metal news. Thank you to those of you who join us day in and day out, and we'll see you all very soon.